Romania tests IAR-99 SM light attack aircraft armed with German IRIST air-to-air missile. The German IRIST air-to-air missile has been integrated into Romania SIAR-99 SM aircraft. One of these missiles was attached to a test bed during a visit by Stefan Sijurn, the vice president of the European Commission, at the Incas Institute in Bucharest. The Romanian Minister of Research, Innovation and Digitalization, Bogdan Gruia Ivan, highlighted Romania's involvement in a drone project featuring local production of optoelectronic equipment and computer systems. He also mentioned that the Incas Institute is assisting in the creation of a Romanian-designed drone prototype. The IAR-99SM Modernized Standard Program focuses on upgrading 10 IAR-99OM standard aircraft to the SM variant under a 2020 contract between the Romanian Ministry of Defense and Avio Ancra Yava. Testing of the first upgraded aircraft began in December 2023 with the remaining nine aircraft in various stages of repair or modernization. The program, scheduled for completion in 2024, aims to prepare Romanian pilots for operations on F-16 and F-35 fighter jets while retaining capabilities for close air support and low-speed air target engagement. The modernization includes advanced avionics systems compatible with NATO standards, such as a head-up display, multifunctional displays, and embedded virtual avionics systems. These upgrades, supplied by Elbit Systems, enhance the IAR-99SMS role in advanced pilot training and extend its operational lifespan by 10-15 years. The aircraft are also equipped for air-to-air -air and air-to-ground combat, including integration with the IRIST missile. Additional improvements include logistical support and systems designed for training, close air support, and maintaining operational readiness. These updates aim to align the IAR-99SM with current requirements for both training and operational missions within the Romanian Air Force. The integration of the IRIST air-to-air missile, observed during tests in 2023, marks a significant enhancement positioning the IAR-99SM as a versatile trainer and light attack aircraft. However, this project was discontinued in 1994 after limited progress. In 1996, the program resumed with Elbit Systems, resulting in the IAR-99C OIM, which incorporated avionics compatible with the MiG-21 Lancer upgrade and modern training systems. The OIM variant first flew in 1997, with 12 units delivered to the Romanian Air Force by 2008, though fewer than originally planned. The IAR-99 was Romania's first jet trainer and light attack aircraft fully designed and built domestically to replace the L-29 Delphin and L-39 Albatros trainers. The project began in the 1970s and the first prototype conducted its maiden flight on December 21, 1985. Serial production started in 1987, with a total of 27 aircraft, including prototypes, built by Avio Ancra Yava. It was designed as a domestically produced solution for training and light attack roles. Over time, the IAR-99 underwent several upgrades to meet evolving operational needs, including avionics modernization and compatibility with NATO standard systems, ensuring its continued service within the Romanian Air Force. The aircraft is built with a semi-monocoque structure, featuring tapered wings and a swept-back tail unit. It is powered by a Rolls-Royce Viper MK.632-41M engine, capable of producing up to 1,814 kgf thrust. The tandem cockpit is equipped with Martin Baker MK-1000 ejection seats, with the instructor S seat elevated for better visibility. The avionics, integrated with a MIL STD-1553B data bus by Elbit Systems, include a head-up display, multi-function displays, and embedded virtual avionics. The IRIST Infrared Imaging System Tail Thrust Vector Controlled is a short-range air-to-air missile developed by a German-led European collaboration to replace the AIM-9 Sidewinder. 
the program be